What is going on guys? Duck144 here today back with another video. Now guys, as you can tell by the title of today's video, you clicked on this video because you are thinking about buying or buying a Nintendo Switch of summer 2018. And I'm going to let you know what you need if you're going to be buying that Switch this summer or if someone else is buying it for you or if you're getting it for your birthday or if you're just getting it because you know it's the best console out there on the market right now. So. First up, I don't know if these bundles like are available anywhere anymore, but there is the Super Mario Odyssey bundle, the Splatoon 2 bundle, and then of course the regular Nintendo Switch bundle. Personally, I don't think those are probably going to be around as much, but if you can find the Splatoon 2 or Mario Odyssey bundle, buy that because then you get the game, a case, and you get the cool color Joy-Cons that come with it as well. So if you do have your chance to get your hands on that console, definitely do it. But if you can't find those, because they're probably sold out everywhere, you can get the normal neon or the gray colored Joy-Con consoles in it. Now in the box of one of the standard editions is of course your dog face controller where your Joy-Cons go in it and then the dock and all the cords you need to play the console on the TV. So that would be your basic requirements for the console of course to play either handheld or on the dock. It all comes in the box so you won't need to buy anything like that. First up, you're going to want to get your hands on a Pro Controller. Now, if you can't afford the Pro Controller because this banks in about $70, you can get your hands on the Wired Controller. They have many, many different options. There's this company that makes them that has like Splatoon designed, Donkey Kong designed, Mario designed. They have all these really cool different Wired Controller designs. It runs at $30. bucks. you are going to save a lot of money and they pretty much do the same thing. The only one this one has that's different from that one is that it's wireless. It has the Amiibo Reader and it has the HD Rumble equipped in it. So, I mean, this is a really really great controller but if you can't afford it there's always that wired one but definitely get a controller especially if you're gonna be playing your switch on a TV next up here's three games that I think you should get no matter what if you are buying a switch right now I know there is a ton and a ton of games okay I there, there's a lot but here's three games I really think you should buy especially if you're buying this summer first up Splatoon 2 the best multiplayer shooter out there right now and there's still so much content coming to this game the octo expansion just came out as well on it it's awesome a lot of fun definitely pick this up if you're buying a switch next up the legend of zelda breath of the wild now yes i know this came out on launch but this this right here is one of the best games on the nintendo switch if not the best right now it's amazing if you buy a Switch, you need to play this game. Even if you're not a Zelda fan, just play it because it's breathtaking. No pun intended. It's just a really, really awesome game. And the final game is Super Mario Odyssey. I mean, if you're buying a Nintendo console, you've got to buy a Mario game. And this is the best Mario game on the Switch right now. A close runner-up is Mario Rabbids Kingdom Battle. I absolutely love that game. But definitely get this one. You're going to love it. It's just like Super Mario 64, but newer, better. And there's so much to do in it. And you have to collect all the moons. Just, just get it. You'll be happy with it. So those are three games that you should be getting if you're buying a Switch this summer. So basically, to sum things up, all you really need is a Pro Controller, those three games, and everything else is in the box and included. So with all of that included, you're going to be spending around just under $500 with those three games, the Pro Controller, and of course the console, which one runs at $300 by itself. Now, all of this, you are going to get so much playtime, so much enjoyment out of the console just from those three games and having that Pro Controller. And also having that Pro Controller will allow you to have two players playing because you can use the Joy-Cons, the Pro Controller, actually three, you know, if you do get Mario Kart as well. So those three things are going to be what you really need if you are a new owner to a Nintendo Switch this summer. So guys, I hope this video helps with you guys that are going to be buying Switches this summer. Let me know down in the comments if you are getting a Switch this summer. So guys, like and comment down below. Smack that subscribe button if you're new. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace! Woo! Oh, hey, and, and don't forget to uh, download Fortnite. It's free. I, I should have said that.